With your object selected, come up to Z plugin UV Master and click Work on Clone. This will create a proxy mesh at the lowest subdivision level to do the UV work on. If we click on wrap and then hit check seams, we instantly have UVs, but the seams placement needs work. If we enable control painting and toggle on protect, we can paint areas on the model we want to protect from seams. And if we click attract, we can paint areas we don't mind seams. Bear in mind, ZBrush may not follow your painting if it decides it will incur stretching in the UVs. This usually gives us better results, but it's still just one island for the whole object. We can better control the placement of seams by use of polygroups. With polygroups turned on, UV Master will place a seam along the border of each polygroup. Now when we flatten, we can use our transpose tools to edit our islands. Once you're done, just hit copy UVs, then come back to the original model and hit paste UVs. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please hit that thumbs up button. Peace.